reach up. Did a set on that for the camera. That is the golf swing of today's opponent, Tom Merrick. Welcome to the channel. Thanks for having me. We are doing a nine hole match down here at Burnham and Barrow. And you know what, we've just turned the cameras on as the weather has just gone mental. It's, it's, like, it's true links fashion. It's proper links. The, we can see the rain coming in from behind you guys right now. This is gonna be brutal. The back nine is gonna be straight into the wind for all nine holes. We really should have filmed the front nine when it's clear <laughs> blue sky and all down downwind. Wind. <laughs> now we're going straight back into the wind with a black sky. It's going to be good fun though. Tom, what do you play off? Uh, my official handicap is 2.4, which puts me at playing between four, maybe six on harder courses. Okay. I would say at the moment I'm playing worse than that, but if I, I've got it in me if I have a good, a good nine holes. How, how many shots then? Two or three? Nine holes? I'll, I'll take two. Two? Yeah, I'll be, yeah. I'll be, I'll respect myself. <laughs> <laughs> 10th hole is a blind tee shot. Little four irons into the middle of the fairway. And we're both pretty much side Same. by side. Maybe I'm 20, further, 20 back, but it's close enough. Friendly golf. Right guys, just before we get started as well, make sure you check out Tom on YouTube. Lot, a couple of good mo uh, golf mobility playlists on there as well. Sure, I understand how, uh, how messed up golf makes your body. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I am one of those people. Yes. So yeah, check out the mobility. I've actually sent his playlist to a couple of my online students as well that have been using it. So I can confirm it is pretty good. Yeah, right, don't, don't judge it on my golf game. That's, that's, <laughs> all, that's all I'll say. A 168 into, into wind, lies pretty good. I presume there's nothing around the green. I don't think there, there's nothing up there really. Other than now a lot of rain. Like Tom is literally dressed for how the weather was 15 <laughs> minutes ago. Yeah, it was, it was almost too hot and uh, <laughs> Not anymore. Oh, that's nice. I don't know if that's a jumper. It looked like it took off like a jumper, but it may have just stalled a little bit into the wind. Yeah, I think that's just back edge. Nice shot. Good shot. That's the draw. That's the draw. <laughs> that was tight draw. Right, 160 yards. So it's a normal eight iron. Into wind, into rain. I've got a six iron. It's going to do a little nine o'clock to three o'clock swing. Slight down slope though, so it'll launch it lower. Certainly don't need to chase this little short shot at all. That's nice. Struck it well, I think just a touch left of the pin. If it holds the green, I can't see it. I think you've just gone off back edge. Really? Yeah, it, was good. it didn't hold the green. <laughs> Alright, Tom's just gone over the back. Possibly a little jumper. Yeah, it's one of those it's one of those ones you got just a bit too much fringe to putt it. If I was better at gauging yeah, you know, a real linksy golf. It's got a tight lie, little chip. Yeah, nice little checky chip. Sit. That's a bit too much. Simmer, simmer. It's okay. Popped up a bit more. Right, this is a long putt. A bit of a downpour on the greens are going to be a bit slower. Not that slow though. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, actually, I thought I degreened it, so it's not horrific. But it's just bad. Right, both putting for par. Guys, stay tuned for this nine holes. Like the literally, here on in, holes are mega. So good. Massive dunes, long holes, amazing par threes. Bit of wind. Loads of birdies. Come on, turn. And bogeys. Is right, that good? you're back to two under. It's to stay level. It's a good roll. Got one back already. He's only started holding him when he's turned the camera back on. <laughs> 4.20 into wind, the rain has stopped, thankfully. There's a bunker down the right at 2.60, which is probably a very reachable distance with this, with this wind. Not clearing it anyway. Well, you never know. I'm gonna go at that right bunker with a little draw. There's the plan. See it a bit lower. Slightly lower shot. It's a bit pulley. Get a look here with your lie. Well, that dug its heels in as well. Did it? Just over the left edge of that trap. <sighs> right, two irons out. He's going very conventional. Two under with eight to go. Keeping the ball in play. Play to what you can see. He's never played here before, so he's just playing it wisely. I like it. 
just popped a bit high right, but Hang on, sorry, not okay. like in trouble. It just didn't move back for you. No, wind has been off the right. Yeah, it'd be fine. 208 to the pin, so I'd say the 208 pin. That's why you don't hit three iron off the tee. <laughs> it's going to be three iron, three iron at this point. Just flared up, so just pushed it to the right, wind into and off the right, so it's just kind of doubled up on the wind there, flared up and just. Trouble it, it's got a bit of a jumpy lie. Um, I, was here, I think I'm going to hit a five iron. There's nothing around the green, everything's pretty firm. Just get something starting between the trap and the pin, and hopefully it just releases round. Little cutty one. Little cutty one would be nice. Completely just lost. Dropping in with the wind, isn't it? Oh, straight on that trap. Oh, left trap. Splash straight into it as well. <laughs> Big puff of sand as it landed. In fairness, this has done okay, bearing in mind what it could be in. And I've got a straight view of the flag, which from that line from this distance isn't that important. But 170 is a 7 iron. I'm banking on a little jumper to cancel out the wind, or it'll just be short, and then a little chip and putt. Go on, big bounce. That's good. We're on, front edge. Stay there. Stop. I'll take that. In high-ish. Right, left, fair, well, green side bunker. We'll call yeah, it. give me a green side. Yeah, I'll give you green side. Uh, I mean, not much green to work with. Probably best to hit something that's a little bit lower, a little bit chunkier, releasing round. Yeah, a little chunk and charge just past that sprinkler. Yeah. Trickle its way down onto the green. Going up and down. Oh, that's popped, hasn't it? Ah. Popped up. It's the first bunker up. I've been in today, to be fair. They're very nice. Like, <laughs> I hate it when you play bunkers and some of them are like really firm, really soft, and then some of them have like, you know, you're going to the nice. beach and you're digging yourself out. You're at a good quality golf course here. It's consistent all the way. Right, it's birdie time. This would be a surprise after the tee shot, but we'll take it. Downhill, left to right, downwind as well. Go, 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 go! Ah! That was in the center of the hole. In the jaws. Right, for a four as well, to stay two under. Clinging on here, really. Rolling. <laughs> I rammed it, but have I rammed it in the hole? He's rammed it into hey. the hole. Woo! I'll take that all day. Firm in the middle. <laughs> Nowhere else was it? <laughs> Nowhere else. Two fours. <laughs> right, stay tuned for the next one. It's like a, it's like we're hitting up a, a drain pipe with dunes left and right. Look at that. What a what a picture I painted. It is, it is a gorgeous golf course. Doesn't make you feel very nice when you're <laughs> yeah, when you're spraying when it. you're spraying it a bit. <laughs> this is a par four. Par four. Memory serves. It's a long one. Yeah, it's up the hill into the wind. You're probably going to have a good mid iron into the green, I think. It says 430 to the pin. 430 to the pin. What's it's that left bunker? 275 to the top of it, so yeah. maybe 260. 260 to fall in. Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely a oh, it's definitely a driver. It's a big drive. This. Get this. Get this ball away down the middle of the fairway, it's an okay hole. Miss the fairway and it's a disaster. Oh, stay, 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 stay. That's not great there, but it's not horrendous. Have you got space on that right side? It's in the it's in the rough, but it's not in like it's not well last it's time I was here it wasn't awful. So for those that didn't know, this is where final open qualifying was for the Open Championship this year. This is where Justin Rose won and qualified from. With a, I think he shot eight or nine under for the two, for 36 holes. Eight or nine, okay. Decent golf, isn't it? Yeah. He's half decent player, that Justin fella. He's, he's all right. Probably should take it professionally or something, you know. <laughs> okay, we're gonna trust the draw. Trust it. It's very sociable. Ah, uh, wind's just holding it up a touch. I keep thinking the wind's coming this way, but... It was, wasn't it? Yeah. Was it were left? It almost like S-bended through the air. It's just oh. sort of just peeled off. Well, you'll f we'll find one of ours at least, because they're <laughs> next to each other. Well, we found mine. That's not ideal. That is going to be layup territory from 130 yards to the front edge. Tom's is just next to his bag there. We'll get to that in a minute. So what are you thinking when you're laying up here? Are you thinking, like, what do you want to chip in? Are you going for a yardage? I'm not going for a yardage. 
I'm just going. Front edge is 130. So I mean, Wedge, go, has, Wedge has got a chance if he catches. So lot. Wedge has got half a chance, but the, uh, there's. I also <laughs> know that half enough. a chance is no chance yeah. without life. When I say half a chance, I can't even see it. Look, <laughs> so he's got no chance. But I know there's a bit of a downslope as well. So if I get a bit lucky, I've got enough club to make it. Yeah. And if I don't get lucky, then I know I'm just on the front edge or I'm 10, 15 short. Flags at the back. Yeah, it's on that back tier. So it's about 30 yards. It's going to be at least a 30 yard pitch from sh off the green. So if this can get lucky, that'll be a big help. It's well out. I think big things with that shot is not doing, not being silly and leaving it in this stuff, which I hope I haven't done. You said he had 130 to the front from back there. That's not what I said. 145 pin from here. So it's How is it? Well at the back. I've got 118 front edge. Yeah, so. I mean, well, that fills me with a bit of optimism as to where my ball could be. I, I don't know if there, there's no traps there. No. I mean, I've been sending everything long today, but everything's been downwind. Yes, exactly. This is a completely different nine holes. This golf course is basically nine out, nine back. And the nine out was heavily downwind. And everything front pin, everything rolling through. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? Everything was front pin as well, wasn't it? It was well hard. I've got 1.5. I'm just going to knock down a pitching wedge. And if it's short, it's fine. It's not going to go long. Not short of the green, short of the pin. <laughs> You'd be really happy if it was short of the green. <laughs> Could be good. Oh, that could be good. That is all over it. Oh, it's short. Short of the green. <laughs> oh, ho, ho. there's a massive slope, and he's just about clung <laughs> on for dear life. <laughs> oh my god. Joe, I thought that was in the hole. It literally never left the pin, did it? Yeah, that was nice. Just out by two clubs. <laughs> <laughs> right, I am short of the green. It's fine, but it's about 40 yards. I'm going to fly it all the way zip it with a bit of rippage it's going to look amazing on camera you're really testing my cameraman skills <laughs> flying it all the way not my best i built it up i was disappointed all right time with the birdie put now obviously from this sort of distant <laughs> in pars <laughs> what are you trying to say i'm just going to go with the last hole and hit it hard at the cup I hate tear putts, it's just so hard to gauge, especially when it's midway through. But it's all uphill, all up into wind, so I feel like at least I can hit this one. Yeah, you can be you can be aggressive. Oh, I said I can hit it, but it's <laughs> <laughs> God. It's a, it's just over halfway folks. Maybe I underestimated that's like 70 feet. It's a long way, yeah. Cool. That is terrible. So yeah, it's quite an awkward five word sentence I've got here, but you've not lost your turn. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's never a good time. <laughs> In golf, that is never I a good time. I think idea. I could have full swung that putt. I think you could have, probably should have got your hybrid out. <laughs> I'd, have, I'd have chipped it closer, I'd say that much. Little three words, yeah. I mean, I did. <laughs> and I'm miles away. <laughs> oh dear. It's a good roll, but still. Getting closer. Can have that one. <sighs> right, this would be a win of a hole. Completely unexpected. Not much in this either. Greens don't have a huge undulation. Ah, oh, it's a good part. I keep wanting to read more break. Yeah. Into those. Sometimes when you tell yourself it's not going to do much, you can't trust it, can you? It's two bogeys. It's not what we want. It's not ideal. Um, one under, one over. Thirteenth hole, par five. This is the lot. This is long, actually. Yeah. yeah. So, can you see the hill in the distance? The dune in the distance. That dune in the distance, three eighty. Right, that's your line. Okay. That's the line. Um, into wind, so it's out of range today. Um, there's a little <laughs> normal path. day, flat day. Yeah, no flat days, no problem. A uh, little path that goes across the fairway, but again, it's no no issue. I don't think we can do that this in two, but we'll certainly give it a good go. Well, that's all right. That's nice. I need to take that all day. It's a fairway. Um, 
How far left have we got? Left, right? Not where they are now, where those people walking their dog are. Yeah, so it's reasonably tight. Little public footpath, it just goes through to the beach. Proper links golf course, this. Front nine, Tom was trying to hit fades with an into out swing path. <laughs> I had to correct him. It's just about trusting it now. <laughs> oh, yes. It's that money. Is money. <laughs> That's long. So he's pretty, he knows what he's doing about this golf stuff, doesn't he? Oh, yeah. Oh, does he? One tip. Fairway finder. He knows his stuff. Right, we've got a long way. 280. What do we want to do? Oh, you know what I've got, folks? What have I got in here? It's very special. Now, if you head over to Instagram and every other platform, we're going to do a little one-iron challenge later. I'm going to hit this now. <laughs> 280. Two, I'm not going to hit 280, but... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to hit it because it's just nice to hit. It really needs a new grip. I've had this grip on it since I was 16. 278, one iron. Sounds good, doesn't it? Sound like a player. Sounds like money. All right, watch. There we go. Come on. Squeezy one iron. Oh, no. Oh, it's, everything sounded so good. It's top of the hill on the left. <laughs> Not good. Great strike. All right, Tom, what have you got? I've got 220 front. 220 foot. Which is kind of, it's like a, it's a teaser yardage because it's, it's gettable, but it's just howling into it. Get your three wood out. <laughs> <laughs> if it's remotely gettable, then it's three wood. Uh, it probably is three wood. That's I was going to say, I don't know if it's rule. three wood. That ah, looks tight, doesn't it, down here? It's when the, the sand dunes start to frame <laughs> the hole. <laughs> don't talk yourself out of it. It's not tight at all. There's loads of space for a golf ball. Look how small the golf ball is. <laughs> compared to that space. <laughs> loads of it, loads of space. Got a bit of grass behind the ball, so probably put a touch back in the stance. Oh, brilliant. Look I mean, I'd take trap. Yeah. Straight in it. Yeah, straight into the left <laughs> bunker. But that is a very good shot. Very good shot. I thought you were trying to talk yourself out. You could, well, actually, in fairness, <laughs> You couldn't I can't, try to talk yourself out of the it. The camera's anymore. here now. I can't. I can't back off. <laughs> if you call three wood, I've got it. Three yeah. wood. Yeah, you can't back off. You'll be outed. This is not good, but could be worse. It's rolling. I think I might have to zoom in a bit because you're so far away from the fairway. <laughs> That's harsh, but fair. Right, I've got 80 to the front. I think into wind. Ball below my feet from a sand dune, so it's a sand, it's basically a, it's like a massive fairway bunker this, but on the side of a hill. This is all hands, all hands and arms, legs stay still, do not get involved. Oh, I've gone the wrong direction. Where are you going? Roll an ankle coming down here. Whoa. Uh, well, that is not good. That is harsh. I think, I think I've been punished for You've that goal shot. You've been very, very punished. Also, I'm going to move around to the side because we're going to get hammered with sand as soon as you make impact. It's not quite as steep, to be fair. It's just I've got absolutely no follow through. What's oh. this? Just hit it as hard as you can. I think it is a bit of a just... You should just launch straight up into the air. You're into wind as well. Yeah. You do very well to hit this too far. So I think it is just smash it into the clouds. You can get a stance. I didn't know what to video you getting peppered with sand or the ball. Oh, there's nothing worse than driving home with sand down your back. Oh no. And your boxers. A nice trip to the beach. And soft. Oh, you had nothing to work with there. Yeah, that bunker shot you probably could have clubbed up. Yeah, I just... the distance. Go, 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 go. Go! Oh, it was tracking as well, wasn't it? it? Oh, the weather is back. Clear blue sky doesn't last a full day over here. Do Sit. It. Oh, four. Wow, I hit that way too hard. Right. Staring a double down the barrel. Oh, oh that's a good effort. Double bogey. You can have that. You can have that? You can have that. Right, one under, three over, four shot lead. Right, the wind is coming down heavy, folks. 190 yards, 
into the wind, uphill, par three, into rain. You're not okay either side, if I'm honest. <laughs> You've got to be super accurate here from 190. It's pretty good. Find that though, you take that You're on the dance floor. I've actually got a little four. I'm just going to give it my little, I like my little L to L swing with these. Little punchy one. Just try and, the only thing I've got to do is just make sure I control the face. Ah, oh, a little draw would have been great, but a big bounce would be even better. Wouldn't be Lynx Golf without this weather, I don't think. I mean, I don't need the full experience. <laughs> <laughs> right, up the hill, right to left, down the hill. Oh, it's not gone up the hill enough. I, I find those incredibly hard. Like, how are you judging that? Are you thinking... It's a guess. Is it a guess? You're trying to think about the pace that's coming yeah. off there? Sometimes you aim too far and then you give it a hard, you hit it hard, it doesn't take the slope as much. No. Do it. Oh. oh. Great effort. Got that one past the hole. I need to stop giving myself 50 foot for birdie. <laughs> uh, Tom, I'll be honest with you, for some bizarre reason, I put my putter back in the bag. So can I borrow your putter? <laughs> <laughs> I've got no idea why I put that back. It's nice, this. It doesn't work, but... <laughs> it looks nice. It looks nice. At least you came prepared. Did I? <laughs> if I knew there was rain, I would have come. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely par. Tom has opened up a five shot lead. Come on. <laughs> oh, rain. Based on the front line, who'd have thought it? I, I, I have to agree. Guys, we've made our way over to 17. The weather has been horrendous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So basically Tom has got a five shot lead with two to play now. <laughs> <laughs> but we've got, I just wanted to film these last two holes because they are spectacular. This one, is par three, 203 yards to the pin. Well, this is gonna be straight into the wind and straight into the rain. Drenched, middle of summer, England. What a place. What a time to be alive, eh? Right, oh my God, it's, yeah, it's wet. Hold on, hold on to your grips. Four iron, low punchy, drawy one. Go, 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 go! Ah! Oh, it's on like the front edge bank. A little bit more in there, could have given it. But then again, I was holding on for dear life. <laughs> oh, he's tried to save it at the end. He's tried to save it at the end. Right, no green in reg for us. Take it back, I did hit the greening regulation, albeit by six inches with 60 foot to go. Just round to this side, Tom. Every shot's worth two at this late stage. <laughs> it's a little on the low side. Right, uphill, right to left. Can't be short. My word. When that left the face, I was worried. All right, it's a put off, two par putts. Oh, is in you go. Oh, part, part of me is a bit gutted. <laughs> well, <that's been> <laughs> I changed my line last minute, I was like, no, I've been reading too much break all day. Right, Tom leads by uh, six, going up the last. <laughs> it's not how I thought this day was going to end, to be honest with you. Well, I mean, I'll start with the weather, it's not how I, I mean, none of it is. As, as a place, it is. it's spectacular, look at that. On a normal day, this is a 
a three wood to the corner, but this is not a normal day. It might be a normal day here, but it's not a normal day that I'd play golf in. This was just a normal flat calm day. Last time I played it, it was a three wood and I went long over the fairway. Okay. So I think the driver, we're going over, see this path, this like grass path here? Yeah, just left. I feel like, that's the, the I feel like that's the line. Maybe that green bush. That's, yeah, around there. You could probably get away with being even left, slightly left of it. That far left? I don't know. I've never tried to do that before. I I mean, with that dog was, leg, that might be okay. It might be all right. It was felt like a bit of a pull, but it wasn't massive. God, I felt very restricted on the way down then. So like, start raining, your body's sort of just like tensing up. <sighs> to try and avoid the... Let's put weight on my left foot. Oh, we spun out of it. It's spun up high. It needs yeah, to land it's soon. cutting into the wind, isn't it? I think it's okay. Yeah, it's bounced. You spun up, you spun out of it, and it's gone high enough that it's fine. Guys, today was just not to be, was it? So, both lost our balls off the tee. <laughs> wow. Honestly, so the clubhouse this afternoon was vibing. Like it was buzzing. People sat outside drinking beers, just loving life. How the weather can come to this is completely. Well, it's not beyond me because I've seen it happen before, but it's just so frustrating. So I hope you've enjoyed the video. Give us a massive like and subscribe because look at the weather we've just played in, man. Beautiful golf course. Massive thank you to Burnham and Barrow. Two times in a row I've been here and it's rained, so just so unlucky. But next time we're going to bring a glorious video of 18 holes from this amazing golf course. Massive thanks to Tom. Folks, I take it back. I take it back. Stop the press. He's found his ball. I, I didn't back him. I didn't help him for very long, to be honest. I tried to look for mine. Anyway, he's found his ball. Six shot lead and I'm no longer in the hole, so it's safe to say he is your winner. If you've never followed Tom before, head over some really, really interesting videos about mobility in general, body weight flexibility, body weight workouts, and obviously there's a golf mobility playlist on there as well. Really, really interesting stuff. And stuff that not a single go oh, <laughs> that could be the end of his day now. <laughs> oh, right. Wow. Thank you, Burnham and Barrow. You're a legend. Yeah, that, that last shot didn't work out. But Tom, thanks for coming on. It's been enjoyable. It's been enjoyable. <laughs> it. It's been enjoyable. Thank you, mate. I'm gonna give you the win, all right? I'm gonna give you the victory. A victory with a, a little hozzle on the, on the last hole. Oh. Hozzle rocket to see us off. It feels somewhat, you know, empty. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what a, honestly, this is an amazing golf course. I hope you've enjoyed it. We'll see you next time. Right, let's go dry off.